and now to a good state where the governor, Dr. Abiodun, has assessed Nigeria's wealth resides with the youth, despite the abundant hoard, solid minerals, and other natural resources the nation is blessed with. Abiodun made the assertion in a lecture he delivered after the fourth convocation ceremony of the Mountain Top University, a good state, declaring that Nigerian youth are knowledgeable, vibrant, with indomitable spirit. Speaking on the topic, the youth as catalyst in building Nigeria's future. This has a significant dimension of leadership predicament in Nigeria is due largely to the disenfranchisement of the Nigerian youth. He, however, charged the youth to channel their energies by exploring new frontiers in the different areas of human endeavors that will bring the desired development to all facets of the economy. <coughs> to collectively change the destiny of Nigeria like today's youth. Developments in technology have put in their hands great power to contribute to national development. For youth to be good leaders, inventors, and innovators, it's important that they supported and provided good health, training, and education to transform the future. The last census confirms to us that the youth population is a great asset for Nigerian states if they are harnessed and utilized the right direction. Interestingly, the transition of society from one generation to another is critical in the formative and development aspiration of any society. In his remarks, the Chancellor, Mountain Top University, Dr. Daniel Lukoye, while congratulating the guardians, noted that the school was set up to provide an all-round education that would make its products compete favorably with the best anywhere in the world. Let us continue to blaze the trail and extend the focus of knowledge to research and innovations which shall not relate our efforts by the special case of growth. Our youth must be taught across ways, and this can only be achieved by establishing a university different from the conventional ones by completing with our children the spiritual aspect of life at an early age. While prepared to be competitive in the employment market, we have introduced training in international IT and in business professional skills and certification for our partnership with New Horizon System, a leading ICT training and international testing institute in Nigeria. I am delighted to report that the university has increased its collaborative effort in academic and professional relationships during the season and currently working in collaboration with Harvard University in Michigan, USA, the University of Feda in South Africa, Vega International University in India, and the Muda University in Cameroon. The highlight of the event was the presentation of two million naira to the best graduating student, Miss Victoria Amechi from the Department of Biological Science with a GPA of 